pride. It's a wonderful word. And it's our word. It's because you need an opposite to shame. And it's the right opposite to shame. Uh, name is Andrew Lumsden. I was on the first Pride March in 1972. My name's Jamie. I am a 23-year-old postgraduate student and I am also transgender. We weren't allowed to be out in any way that anyone could recognise. We were smeared at every possible opportunity in legislation and in language on the street. Batty boy, pansy, fruit, all the words were deeply offensive when you, you took them into yourself. I tried to accept myself as female and fit in when I was like 14, 15, 16. That didn't go so well. The atmosphere of uh, an ordinary British police station was homophobic and often violently so. Last year, my girlfriend and I went to Pride for the first year. We were contacted by somebody in Pride who was like, oh, would you like to be a flag bearer and carry the British flag? I was like, OK, I'll do it. I'm scared, but I'll do it. We had been abused for centuries in every possible way. And this is why we took to the streets. It was when it set off. It was kind of most of the nerves just went. I think there were a few hundred of us that first time. We had no idea whether there would be trouble. There were so many people along either side just looking really happy and cheering and waving. And were the public enraged? Did the public tear up the paving stones and throw them at us? No, they didn't. People were opening office windows and they were looking out and they were going, yeah, yeah. We were out in the open, we were out in the air, we were doing what the state said you mustn't do. We were there being seen. The overall feeling of the day was just incredibly positive. I didn't realise quite how powerful the environment was and the sense of community and the togetherness. It was the young of the future we were thinking about. We didn't want them to go through what our generation went through. By telling kids that being trans exists and it's something that's possible, it's not going to make them trans. It's just going to make those kids that have those feelings feel more accepted. Pride. Pride in the sense of whatever you do to me, deep down as the blows come, I'm proud. Come on, come on, come on. The march will be over by the time us lot get there.